opponent, you're still the WWE Champion. What can you say about your opponent, Daniel Bryan, here tonight? I could say about Daniel Bryan exactly what I would have said about Daniel Bryan if you asked me before the match. He's probably one of the toughest guys I've ever wrestled. The fact that we've made it this far and we've carried our rivalry to these heights, it's pretty amazing. Tough guy. Um, I'll wrestle him any day of the week. Now, uh, Punk, clearly a little worse for wear here tonight. A uh, number of uh, injuries uh, here. Uh, some people would say that you tapped at the end of the match. Uh, do I you did. I did tap. I tapped after I pinned him. You know how many times I tap out a day? You know how many times I tap out a week? There's no shame in tapping out. I'd rather tap out and live the fight another day when it counts, when it matters. When this title is on the line, he's going to take my arm off before I tap. But after I pinned him, I'll tap. There's no shame in that. He's, he's a submission artist. He makes people hurt in places they didn't realize they had places. Yeah. Well, do you think that he has a right to... Uh, he clearly wasn't happy with the result of the match. Do you think he has a right to argue against that decision? Have you ever, have you ever lost the chance to be WWE champion. Have you, ever, have you ever lost a big game? Maybe, um, you know, just lost a chance to, to do something great? Of course he was mad. I'd be mad at that result, too. The only reason I'm happy right now is because I won. Does he have a, uh, a claim for a rematch? Absolutely. You know, in any given day, I can't tell you if Daniel Bryan or CM Punk wins a match. I just know when I'm in there, bell to bell, there's nobody better. He makes me better you know and like I said I I won't I won't give up I won't quit on myself or anybody who believes in me when this title's on the line